Hello everybody and welcome to this Extra Suite installation tutorial video. The first thing you need in order to install Zextra Suite is the Zextra Suite package. You can find the download link on the Zextras website at www.zextras.com. As you can see, I'm downloading it directly to my Zimbra server using the wget utility. Once the package is downloaded, you need to unpack it using the tar command. When tar is done unpacking, enter the new extra suite folder with the cd command. To begin the installation process, just launch the installation script. If it's launched with no arguments, a usage message is displayed. To install both the Zextra Suite Core and Simlet, launch the script with the all argument. The script will check for existing Zimbra or Zextras installations. Next, you will be asked to accept the software license agreement. After a couple of information messages, you will be asked if you want to proceed. As you press yes, you will be prompted with a message about stopping the Zimbra services. Answering yes again will start the Zimbra shutdown procedure, while answering no will abort the installation process. After all the Zimbra services are shut down, the Zextra score will be installed. After the Zextra score has been installed, you will be prompted to start the Zimbra services to allow the Zimlet deployment. Answer yes and the startup will be automatic. Check out the mailbox log for the status of the deployment. The Zextra Suite installation has been completed. Now we'll try some basic commands to check if the core is functional. Now we log into the Zimbra administration console to check out if the Zimlet is correctly installed. And as you can see on the left menu, there's a Zextras entry with three pages, core, backup and notifications. That's the main interface for the software. On the core, you can find general information about your license and update status, along with some configurations for the notification emails. In the backup section, you'll find all the configurations for the Zextras backup module as you can see, 
it has not been initialized yet so we just press the run full scan now button to initialize the software the backup path will be automatically created if not existent thank you everybody for watching this video you can find many more videos about Zextra Suite and Zextra's migration tool on our YouTube channel or joining the community at forums.zextras.com.